your open guard is literally put this balance and get to the top. So Mike and John had a question about how do I just get to the top from here. Look, I'm here, and if I feel him already right about there, and I can help him sit back right there, look, I'm gonna pull myself in here, okay? So now it's a fight for the top. The advantage I have is that he can't quite get his left leg back. I have the lapel, but now my left leg's gotta come back as I gotta just come up and literally just come up, okay? There's no real particular technique because it depends on what side you're on. But this is all, not even you sweeping them. This is all them just sitting back. Yes, right here, look. Maybe I can come back this way here. Go this way. Okay, hand leg go. You have to figure out how to get up. You're either, but the one way you're probably not gonna get up is straight because your own legs are in the way. So if I'm here and I wanna get up, I'm probably gonna get up that way. Probably not gonna get up that way. Okay, because my legs are in the way. So you have to move your legs out of the way. Problem is that you have their lapel. So you're gonna tilt, you can tilt this way. I like tilting to the left. But you gotta understand that in this whole process, when you get good enough <clears throat> at playing lapel or whatever it may be, you're gonna feel them trying to back out of your guard. And this is where it becomes very powerful, okay? Because here, oftentimes they're just gonna stand up. Okay? They're gonna stand up, okay? And if they begin to stand up, you have a lot of leverage. Posture up, because it's hard for him to stand up, okay? From here, and still, lift this up. This out. And then figure out how to get up, 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 up. There's a certain way, certain time that you're using the lapels to sweep, but then there's a lot of you mentally thinking, how do I get up, up, up? Okay? Let's just do one more. Without him even standing up. Because the great thing here is that. You have the opportunity to attack two arms, okay? From here, what I can also do is he puts up his foot, okay? I can begin to convert and attack his arms here. If he hides his head, tucks it, I can begin crawling up his back right here, okay? From here, I'm driving him that way, if he begins to drive back into me, you still got the one. I still have the squid. I never let go. Why would I let go? Yeah. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. I'm looking to constantly shift his weight. Rocking forward, back, push, pull, rotate. But do you see how far up on his back I am? Look. Over here, one, two, three. Look, I'm literally on his back. Look, I'm here. That's a super tight sweep, <laughs> right? Okay. Yep. So you're like on the knee, you're inverted, but on reality, their weight is attached to you due to the lapel. So look, maybe I want to fake attack in this arm. And I really want that on. Look. Oh, look. He pulled that arm out. I'm a plotter. Okay. He's going to be kind of strong here. Okay. If you, if you didn't sleep him but tried to finish the almond plotter, would you keep hanging on to the. No, I'd let go. You'd let go okay. Yeah, you don't have to look. You have to also not get too married to that lapel guard and begin to cycle through other guards. Look, I've got this here. I've got this. 
And I pushed it here. Well, I push it in my pocket. Here, look. Right here. Look. Okay. He's just falling. Okay. So it's kind of like. But I know that in reality, yeah, that, that's, yeah, that's, that's what he would yeah. do, which is fine. Okay. This here. John, what would you do? Um, I'd try and get this out, which it's not going to, so I'd probably try to get some weight on him. Good. You see how tangled up he is? Yeah. I'm perfectly fine. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm just thinking, he got no base. I got his mm -hmm. left leg and left arm. He got can't roll out of that, right? No. It's important yeah, yeah, yeah. for you guys to feel it because this, once you get comfortable, the beauty with the squid is for you to invert. Look, I fed it here and I immediately attack this arm here. Okay? Go ahead, go. Yeah. Pulling me. Okay. So you're tangling him up in your web of open lapel guard deception. The question is, what do you want to do, John? Can we, is, it, is it always left lapel? It's for this. It's their left lapel for the squid. I mean, I theoretically could do it here. But it's gonna be short. I can do it. I want arm lock. He pulls it out. That's actually tighter. <laughs> it's way tighter. <laughs> here, I switch it here. 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 Look. Okay. Now, now I'm, I'm gonna sit here. I just don't want him to kick me here. Okay. So where's he gonna go? Nowhere. John, where are you gonna go? No, I'm in there. To your knee. I may, I may do that. Okay, good. Look, I got his shoulder, got his arm, I got everything. Now the question is, is he gonna posture up, or is he gonna kind of, what, like, what, like, like? I feel, I feel his weight. If he postures up, I'll roll over my right shoulder and pull him this way here. If he drives forward. And look, still a little pillow, and then you go, and then you let it go. Okay? So you have a lot of options, but it takes time to practice. But anything that you're going to be willing to get good at requires any form of practice. This is not happening. But when you get even okay at this, you have a huge advantage. So, look, try and burden. Look, this is all off his knees. Okay? Look. Grab it here. Okay. Maybe not. I let go. He postures. Bring the knee down and lift up. Right back. Switch that. Look. In here. Look. He pulls that arm out. Triangle. Mm -hmm. Okay. Triangle. Plotter. Yeah, I like to switch the grip here so I can get his leg here and be tight. Simple. Okay? Look, he stays strong on his right knee. Look what I can also do. Stay, stay, stay up. Take your right arm, left arm out. Okay. I just don't want to. Mm -hmm. Tilt him with his knees and off yeah. because he doesn't know what I'm doing. You have a lot of options, a lot of opportunities. And then you learn. Sorry. Also, your feet, he stands up. It doesn't, you know. Look. It's real simple, but really super powerful. 
Ollie, what are you gonna do? What else are you gonna do from there? They stand up. What are you gonna do? Look. You're down. Open your butt. What are you gonna do when I'm standing? Did you see that? He needs four points of contact. Mm -hmm. He's got a daily heal. Okay, good. So he's got four. Look. There's two gone. Mm -hmm. What are you gonna do now? Go. Okay. What are you gonna do now? How about, yeah. How about you just reach? Okay, what are you gonna do now? Oh. Hey, look at that. How nice was that? See, it completely broke me down. But he went into warm guard, right there, okay? Because it's off of my right foot leading. So you guys gotta keep in mind, you gotta pick and start somewhere. What I started was with worm. Because it all made sense off the daily heaver. He puts his right foot up, daily heaver here. Look, the lapel's here. I set up, hook, tap. Pull it past his knee, set it to my right hand, tilt around my left side. He wants to put his hands on the mat, into like a bear curl. Okay, so now I scoot, take my left foot here, pull him up. Question is, do I want his back? Maybe, I can do the kiss of the dragon here. He starts pushing back. Pull that, I'm up. Okay, that's where I started, worm. When you, on your left side, it's warm. One last one. So try this. De la Hiva. De la Hiva. De la Hiva. De la Hiva. Lapel. You're going to push away and I'm going to pull myself up. And I sit up. Left foot drops. Feet under your right leg. <clears throat> under their left leg. I mean under their right leg. From here, he's going to straighten up. Yes. And I'm going to fall on my left side. I pass it back to my... Right hand, as I'm falling on my left side. So my left foot is clamping here, okay? Yeah. Look. Okay, so I'm here. Okay, my left foot blocking. Uh, circle a little bit towards the camera. Try this. Look. Because what am I gonna do here? I'm gonna pull him back that way, like a scissor sweep. <laughs> and his knees. And you have on okay? Because you go right in an S mount right here, okay? So try the worm, keep the squeeze. Okay, let's do it, one, two, three. Until you start using it 